in 1982. These three guys had one of the most insane years in pop music history that so many people don't know about. Let me explain. Steve Piccaro, Jeff Piccaro, and Steve Lukather were high school buddies and three of the go-to studio musicians in Los Angeles during the 70s and 80s. They played on everything. Steely Dan, Alice Cooper, Sonny and Cher, Aretha Franklin, you name it, they were on it. So naturally, in 1982, when Michael Jackson was getting back in the studio with his boy -o Quincy Jones to record his album Thriller, <laughs> These were the guys that got the call. They helped make Beat It, The Girl Is Mine, and Human Nature. And you'd think that getting to be a part of one of the most iconic albums ever would alone make for an amazing year. The story does not end there. See, Steve Piccaro, Jeff Piccaro, and Steve Lukather weren't only studio musicians. They were also in a little band you might know called Toto. And in 1982, the same year they recorded Thriller, one of the biggest selling albums in the history of recorded music, they also put out an album of their own. And the biggest song from that album, a little tune you might have heard called Africa. Pretty good year.